the Irish Gold Cup next up. This is over three miles. It's a grade one. Bit of a precursor to next week's Cheltenham Gold Cup, but over two furlongs shorter. Better Bob Irish at the top for David Robertson. Q card David Hooley, Insatiable Forest Craig Allen, Lawn Tennis Graham, Christopher Ozart, Rival Vinny Gerard, Time to Shine Craig Allen, Twisted Road, Leon Van Rensburg, Achane Byrne, Martin Lidham, Bridged Cape, Darren Thompson, Echo Bell, Alex Cherry, Fern Brook, John Morgan, Lost on the Way, Joshua Sutherland, Magic Spell, Craig Beckwith, Sal's Beauty, David Hooley, and Stone of Legends, Leon van Rensburg. So 15 of them then. No real out and out favourite for the Gold Cup next week. So it could be a bit of a clue this time. They're away and racing. And Fern Brook, the great, is the first to show from Akane Burn on the inside as they get to the first of the 16. Only 16 fences to take. And we're taking considerably more than that next week. And Fern Brook. The Grey is in the lead. Oh, John Morgan with Akane Burn second. Lawn Tennis a second. Grey is in third place. Then comes Echo Bell and Lost on the Way as they get to the second of the 16, which they're all safely to the other side of. Although Insatiable Forest was a little bit sticky at the back. And the John Morgan front running Grey Fern Brook has opened up by the obligatory four or five lengths. Get over the third. From Lawn Tennis and Akane Burn together, second and third, with Lost on the Way on their outside. And then Twisted Road. With Echo Bell and Magic Spell next. Better of Irish was running quite wide on the track, has now been cut in towards the back, leaving Stone of Legends the one who's given away most ground wide on the track. And Fern Brook leads into this ditch, which is number four, and there's a faller there, it's Echo Bell that's gone. So Echo Bell, the first to depart the race. As Fernbrook leaves the field and gets into number five. Looks they've all got over okay, and the two greys, the only two greys in the race, are first and second at this point, Fernbrook and Lawn Tennis. Then Lost on the Way has moved into third, Akane Burn is now fourth. Then comes Magic Spell fifth, and Time to Shine. Is after that one with Ozark Rival. i had a length or so behind that one, and then the rest of them are more in a group with Stone of Legends and Sal's Beauty on the outside as they come to the sixth. Again, they're all over that nicely with Q card and Twisted Road just the back two. Fernbrook bowls along in the lead. Inside the final two miles now, they can pass the big screen. They'll pass the winning post very shortly. And they'll go out on a final track, final circuit of the track. With Fernbrook, a clear leader. Passing the winning post. With Lawn Tennis second, lost on the way third. And Magic Spell fourth, that game burn on the inside is fifth. Then comes Time to Shine, and who's our rival? Stone of Legends on the outside. Insatiable Forest has made some good ground on the inside as they take this ditch. They're all safely over. Jumping well, these, the majority of them. Just lost the one so far. And all safely over the eighth. With Fernbrook, three or four lengths clear. And I've lost on the way. Who is now in second. And then comes Lawn Tennis in third as they get to their next. Over that one, okay. Although Q card wasn't particularly clever at it, and Twisted Road is just getting a little bit detached towards the back as well. But it's Fernbrook who's still in the lead at the 10th. Everybody jumped that one nicely. And Fernbrook pops over that ditch. From Lost on the Way in second, Lawn Tennis is third, and Magic Spell. Then Akane Burn and Stone of Legends. And they gap then to the Craig Allen pair, Time to Shine and Insatiable Forest. As they get to the 12th, as they all get over, the David Hooley pair have dropped to the back, Sal's Beauty and Q card. We find them going a little bit heavy. But Fernbrook. Leads into the 13th. Lost on the way, getting considerably closer in second, though. Ah, 
as are the chasing pack. Magic Spell has moved round into third. Lord Tennis has dropped back to fourth. Okay, Burn still there, then time to shine. Stone of Legends creeping closer. Also Bridged Cape and Twisted Road have started to make a forward move now as well. At the 14th, that's three from home. All safely over the race is now well and truly on. And Fernbrook from Magic Spell. Lost on the way and Lawn Tennis, then time to shine. Then Arcane Burn. This is the second from home. And there's a faller there. It's Lawn Tennis that's gone, been up in the lead for quite some time. And Lawn Tennis has now crashed out of it. As Fernbrook is about to be challenged by Twisted Road, just wonder jump. It's Fernbrook the ground on the far side. Twisted Road closest to us. Then a little bit of a gap back to Insatiable Forest, who's running on exceptionally well around the outside. And Stable Mate, time to shine, trying to come through as well. It's wide open still. This over the final fence they go. And it's Fernbrook who landed in the lead. Fernbrook's over it in front from Magic Spell in second. Lost on the way is in third. Then comes time to shine. Insatiable Forest has gone out particularly quickly. But it's Fernbrook in the lead. A furlong to go. Fernbrook from Magic Spell who's beginning to get closer. These two are clearance between these. It's Fernbrook on the inside. Magic Spell closest to us. It's Fernbrook still just in the lead but Magic Spell is getting closer and Magic Spell is beginning to get up and Magic Spell is getting up to take it. Magic Spell wins it. Fernbrook is second time to shine. Lost on the way. Insatiable Forest Twisted Road and all the way back to Sal's Beauty and Craig Beckwith is having some sort of week because if my memory serves, I think he took a Nunthorpe or something earlier in the week. And now, he's got himself a live contender for next week's Cheltenham Gold Cup. By winning the Irish Gold Cup, Magic Spell for Craig Beckwith the winner. Fern Brook for John Morgan second. Time to shine, Craig Allen third. Lost on the way, Joshua Sutherland fourth. And Insatiable Forest for Craig Allen again was at fifth. I'm going to hand you over to Doug now, who's going to do the rest of the week for you standing for a few races for me as i've got other things i've got to do so i'll be back next week at cheltenham for the big festival meeting